Hello! Welcome to Anime Mystics. I'm Roman, and tonight I am watching... Fix this real quick. I am watching Uzaki-chan wa Oso Osobitai, episode 4. Asobitai. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I pronounced it wrong the first time. Um, let me see, so last episode... We had another, another section where they were at his job. Only we met the owner's daughter who goes to the same college as him and uh, Uzaki. Uh, she also seems to have a muscle fetish. <laughs> and our main dude, whose name I can't remember, seems to work out. So, she likes looking at him <laughs> whenever she can. Uh, then she kind of gets in on the, the dad's uh, hobby of watching the two uh, Uzaki and this dude kind of interact. Uh, she sees him at first when Uzaki comes in and is wondering what's going on. You know, who is this person? Asking the dad, and she's like, oh, look, just just watch. <laughs> and now they're both kind of in the hobby of just watching them interact with each other. Um, let's see. Next, he got sick. Because while he was at work, water splashed on him. Uh, and then he walked home and it was cold and stuff, so he caught a cold. Um, so Uzaki went to go take care of him. You know, she didn't bring anything. <laughs> Not at first, anyway. She got to the place to check on him. Thought that he'd be just a little sick and maybe they'd just hang out and play video games. But that wasn't the case. He's like, out. Can't move that well. He's not really staying awake. You know, he's super tired. So she sees how he is, and he's like, she's like, okay, give, just give me a bit. Leaves, goes to the store, buys medicine. She buys uh, food um, and a few other things. And then makes him his, uh, like soup or porridge or whatever it is that they make um, and just took care of him uh, then when he got well he told her you know you can you can leave I'm about to go to uh, to sleep and you know you don't need to be here you know all this time I'm just gonna lie here and she's like, yeah, I'll go as soon as you actually go to sleep, and then I'll just throw your your key through the mail, mail slot so that you can, you don't have to worry about anything. Which he was appreciative for. But then she started playing video games. <laughs> and she wouldn't shut up, asking him for advice on how to beat people. And he told her, look, just leave. You could borrow the system and the game. Just get out. I'm trying to sleep. <laughs> Um, I think it was the next day because these people get over their colds in a day which has happened to me before but it seems like every time it happens in anime it's like always the next day they're better um, so he's better and the owner and uh, his daughter for the ca cafe say let's go you know, celebrate so they go out to eat and they bring Uzaki as well and they go to like a Korean barbecue place where Uzaki is cooking him his meat and giving it to him. Uh, it's here that she gets kind of upset at him because he calls the owner's daughter by her first name, which I think is Amy? Ami? Something like that? And he doesn't call her by her first name, and he's known her longer. So she's a little upset by that. So the next day, I think it's at school. I think it's the next day. I always think it's the next day. It probably was. She had bought a book on hypnotism. I was trying to hypnotize him so that she could get him to call her by her first name. Um, he wasn't hypnotized, but he pretended to be. And then when she asked that, he's like, is that all? Okay. But it still gave him a little bit of trouble. It took like five attempts to get her name out of his mouth. Which she was happy for, and then she kept asking him, you know, say it again, say it again. And then finally, after that, she's like, okay, 
you're gonna go and you're gonna get me ice cream you're gonna go and you're gonna do this you're gonna get me this video game you know and then he chops her in the head um and she explains you know you call the owner's daughter or Amy or whatever by her first name I'm pretty positive I'm getting her name wrong <laughs> but we'll find out if she's in this episode um so yeah and he's known her longer but all she gets is you know, like you there hey you know stuff like that and he explains look it's hard for me to call a girl by her first name I only call her by her first name because it's much easier for work because if they're both at the shop and I call their last name they can get confused you know so yeah but she was fine with, she was fine with that explanation uh, then he accidentally hypnotizes her and he has no idea how to snap her out of it but she should have just said okay I mean if you looked through the book you probably would have saw you know if they're hypnotized you want to snap them out of it do this which from what I've seen from shows and movies is you know I'm going to snap my fingers once I snap my fingers you'll wake up you know stuff like that um, then when they were at the cafe they were trying to hypnotize her and it wasn't working and the owner was thinking to himself oh so I guess it is true that only people that you really trust can hypnotize you <laughs> which means that he doesn't really trust her that much <laughs> um, because it didn't work on him he pretended to be hypnotized but she completely trusts him because she got hypnotized almost right away and he wasn't even trying really he was just kind of swinging the coin back and forth for a few seconds anyway let's see what's going on in this episode down. Yeah, that should work. Alright. Now we're going to start this episode in three, two, one. doesn't go anywhere. He just wants to be alone. Look at his eyes. Is that... Is that Uzaki? Yeah, that's gotta be Uzaki. So she rang the doorbell, knocked on the door. Rang the doorbell, knocked on the door. I can see that getting a little annoying after a bit. But I mean, if you wouldn't have waited and just answered the door, it wouldn't have been so bad. Even though I know he knew who was at the door and he wasn't trying to open it. <laughs> So what is she going to try to convince him to do now? Are they just going to play video games or what? I don't remember if we saw that cat last episode. Maybe once. <laughs> mm 
<laughs> she was definitely right. <laughs> Doraemon Go? It's like Pokemon Go, but with cats. <laughs> yeah. Fine. I'm about to die of boredom. <laughs> if anything, you're gonna die from lack of sleep. Lousy cat. <laughs> Scully. <laughs> Someone's gonna report you. Gorillas. I thought they were going away. <laughs> to lock up. <laughs> he would, yeah. Glass assistant. Help you pick out a pair of glasses. computer glasses. Ah, yeah, exactly. It's going to be their model. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> A little too flashy for work and school. No, not those. <laughs> <laughs> Those glasses look familiar. That'd be a cool look, though. Want to? <laughs> Embarrassingly tropey character. There's a... 
was good. <laughs> I was gonna say. What do the people in the store think of all this? Yeah, she does. <laughs> you look dumber. Ha <laughs> 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 oh god. Are they all right? Yeah, they're fine. <laughs> it's just what they do now. They argue. Oh, the cat dandy. Another gorilla. Got another gorilla. Cats just don't like him, even in video games. Uh oh. Really? Cyborg? Still gorillas. <laughs> Where are you going? Will he finally get a cat by the end of this episode? More people. Oh. A gorilla! Oh god. He's gonna look and it's gonna be a gorilla. Yeah. Just stop looking around. Just... Okay. <laughs> He's not even paying attention. He's just listening. Is he smelling her shampoo? <laughs> oh, snap. Where'd he go? Grab him.
Did you get a cat finally? A dog. It's an SR though. <laughs> yeah, she was. Did you not call her back after that? Just to at least let her know you were okay? <laughs> Dreaming about you, huh? Nope, nope, she's awake. I like rainy weather. I don't like summer. Ha <laughs> 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 no, you remember what happened last time? Oh God. Probably shouldn't have mentioned that. It's the fact that you didn't come up with it on your own. You had somebody suggest it to you. Nope, she's on her way. <laughs> Super huge, okay. I was, well, I was wondering what it meant. Look at that face. 
didn't expect to be soaked. <laughs> uh. Potatoes, carrots, onions. Could type too much information. Nice. Giving you my old pot. Curry, huh? Okay, it was porridge. <laughs> I'm really sorry I said that. Meowcraft? Oh, wow. <laughs> well, at least he did uh, eventually get some glasses. They didn't show him buy them at the shops. But I'm assuming that's when he bought them. You've been one all along. <laughs> oh, God. Zombies. I'm assuming because it's got the brain thing. Yep, it's good. Seal of approval. And her clothes are dry. <laughs> oh. God knows I'm free. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> wow. at the end here nah was only nine seconds left nope all right so that was a good episode um seems like he's getting used to having her around I mean I'm sure he was already but now it's like despite the fact that it was suggested that he invite her over 
or at least to do something after what happened in Golden Week. He seems to be okay with having her over now. Uh, it looked like they had a good time, so it's not like... I guess like it used to be where she was just picking on him <laughs> and all that. Although she still does pick on him, which is funny. Um, he seems to be used to it for the most part. Um, still a few things that kind of get to him that she says, but now it's just normal. Um, yeah, it's kind of sucky how he was only getting gorillas. What was it? I went to when Pokemon Go was really big. I think people still play it now. I don't really play it all that often anymore. But when it first came out, I think this was maybe a month or two after it had come out. Maybe a little longer. Um, I was at my job one day and I decided I was going to go to this park that was nearby to try and see if there was any good Pokemon over there. There wasn't. Not really, anyway. Um, I walked around that entire park and the only thing I was really getting were Magmars. Which is fine if I really wanted a Magmar and wanted to level them up. But that was all I was getting. And they weren't even like super strong Magmar. They were kind of weak. Every once in a while I'd get a strong one. Like there was, there was one other Pokemon that was there and that was Diglett. And I found one Doug Trio at like 125 power. <laughs> uh, other than that, the park was actually really creepy looking. <laughs> there were still people walking around, but it was pretty creepy looking for a park. And yeah. I felt like it was kind of a wasted visit because I didn't find much. But again, I guess if you were looking for Magmars, that was the place to go. It was almost like a nest. Because there were so many of them. He was getting all gorillas, and I think he got one dog. No cats. Cats seemed to hate him. Both in the real world, well, his world, and in video games. Except for Meowcraft. <laughs> and that's only because you have to play as a cat. I've never played Minecraft. Never really been interested. Um, if you die, does that end that game and you have to start all the way over? Because I've seen some videos, like compilations, uh, I guess where people have been playing the game for a while, and then they die, and they look like they want to kill themselves. Is that what happens? Like, you have to start all the way over, rebuild everything, and start from zero? Because I don't see any other reason why they would look like that if that wasn't the case. Um, but yeah. They seem to be becoming closer friends. Um, going out and doing stuff. He, he even didn't care that she came over the next day. Um, usually I think he'd be like, uh, no. Let's kind of spread this out. But he didn't seem to care. He wasn't even like upset with her that she forgot her uh, her pass at at his place. She just kind of laughed it off and said, alright, let's let's go back. Because, I mean, what else are they going to do? Um, so, yeah. It's gradually watching their relationship get better and better. Alright. So if you enjoyed this reaction, be sure to hit the like and subscribe buttons and get updates on our releases. Check out our Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram for anything else we decide to post. And check out our Discord where you can chat with me or anyone else. It's also a good place to go to see if there are any updates to the channel. So.
So until next week. Bye.